child care is something that's been uh, on the forefront of a lot of people's minds since this uh, a crisis started a few weeks ago, and so I wanted to take an opportunity, uh, along with my Deputy County Executive, Corinda Crosdale, to talk about some of the programs that Monroe County offers, uh, particularly as it relates to the affordability of child care, uh, so that folks in this community uh, can access uh, those programs and understand what benefits are available to them. So I'm joined today by, uh, again, my Deputy County Executive, Corinda Crosdale, uh, who oversees all of our health and human service programs. And, um, uh, and so I'm going to ask Corinda to walk us through um, essentially how our child daycare subsidy works uh, through the Monroe County Department of Human Services. Thank you, County Executive. Um, so we offer child care assistance for low-income families. Um, so individuals who meet the minimum requirement for child care can apply through our local Department of Social Services. And what this program does is it pays all or a portion of uh, daycare expenses. Um, currently through this crisis, we know that uh, family circumstances are changing day by day. We would encourage folks who have not tapped into that resource who may be eligible to go online um, to the Monroe County website and you can apply directly online. You can download that application and fill it out. You can fax it back to us, you can email it back to us, or you can come to one of our offices at 111 West Ball Road or 691 St. Paul Street and we have drop boxes for those um, daycare applications. For individuals who need daycare immediately, we can offer you a 30-day certificate, which will pay for the first 30 days of child care. All we need from you to get that certificate is the daycare application and uh, pay stubs or a letter from your employer letting us know when you start dating. Um, during this crisis, we have made some adjustments to um, our child care subsidy program. Uh, one of the first adjustments we made is a lot of our daycare providers are seeing a decrease in census, which is understandable as folks stay home due to this, uh, social isolation. Um, so we are paying up to 14 days of absences uh, for all of our daycare providers. We need them to say stay solvent so that our essential uh, workers can access those, those daycare sites. We don't want them to close down. And what we are starting today is for those who have a parent fee, everybody's parent fee across the board will be dropped down to $1. So beginning Monday, parents who are already enrolled in our daycare subsidy program only pay one dollar for their their, uh, their parent fee, and this is so that um, our essential workers can utilize the resources that they have to keep their families whole during this crisis. Thank you, and I think that's great. So essentially, what we've developed is a system uh, uh, under Corinda's leadership at the Department of Human Services that uh, uh, allows a streamlined approach. If you need help and financial assistance. Uh, uh, to access daycare because you are an essential worker providing one of those functions. We can help you meet those costs. And uh, the biggest change to the program that's being made effective Monday is that because of that uh, additional funds from our state and federal partners, we're able to reduce that parent fee down to a dollar. So any family who qualifies for child daycare subsidy assistance through Monroe County will now have their fee reduced to a dollar. So it's a, it's a, it's a way to really help those essential employees be able to, to continue working and find safe and reliable daycare for their children. In addition to that, being able to help those daycare centers remain open despite the fact of having a lot of vacancies and, and financial struggles is a good way of piecing that together. So uh, thank you, Corinda, for what you and your team there have done and uh, encourage folks to go to our website at www.monroecounty.gov where you can access all the information you need for these child daycare programs and um, uh, and, uh, and all the forms that you would need uh, to be able to apply. So thank you, uh, uh, for uh, Corinda, for you and your team. And uh, I want to thank again the community for working with us uh, and our, our partners in the state and federal governments for, uh, for working with us on the funding so that we can offer this vital resource. Thank you.